Floods are rapidly engulfing riverine communities in the southern senatorial district of Adamo State, displacing thousands and bringing businesses and social activities to a standstill. The State Emergency Management Agency recently issued a flood warning, urging these communities to relocate to safer areas. Gibson Soadigo reports from Yola. The swelling river Benue has engulfed communities along its banks in Adamawa State, submerging farmlands, homes, places of worship, and businesses. This annual flooding caused by heavy rainfall and water releases from Cameroon's Lactodam has left many areas devastated. In response, the Adamawa State Deputy Governor visited the affected communities in Numan and Demsa local governments urging greater support from the federal government and humanitarian donors. Losses are colossal. Adama State as a government might not be able to bring support to its people because they are citizens of Nigeria. We still want to use this medium to still call on the federal government to ensure that Adama State is part of the people helped because the floods are becoming overwhelming. Concerns are growing that more communities in flood prone areas will be affected. Residents are being urged to relocate to safer grounds to avoid potential dangers. Please move to upper lands because the waters are still coming. Like we have seen today, what we've seen today when we're coming into Numa, with all the volume of water we have seen moving into the river, it means that in the next one or two days, the flood will affect places where it didn't affect in the last two days. So we plead with our people to please move to higher land so that we don't lose lives. We are calling upon the, those that are responsible, uh, including the chairman and the councillors and also the uh, leaders of the community, that they should uh, try and make judicious use of these uh, items that have been given. The Meteorological Agency, NIMET, had issued flood alerts across several states in Nigeria including Adamawa, warning residents to take precautionary measures due to alarming forecasts. Gibson Soadgu, Trust TV News, Yola.